You want your breakfast? Good boy. Stay. Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday. It's early. I'm still waking up. I really wanted to go to the farmer's market today, and I think that's what we will do at some point. I was thinking about the flea market, but then I went last time and I literally found nothing, and I also don't need to buy anything else, except if I do go, I kind of want to look at art, maybe, but I feel like they also don't have that much stuff, so maybe I'll like pop by and see, but... Who knows? To start off my morning, I wanna show you guys kinda of like what I do and it typically starts with skincare and I wanna say a huge thank you to Elemis for sponsoring this video today. And so let's go to my bathroom, I'll show you guys what I do. And um, yeah, just spend the day with me. So my skincare is starting with a cleansing balm. This is the Elemis Pro Collagen Rose Cleansing Balm. So I just take a little bit like this. It's really, really gentle and hydrating. Completely wakes my skin up. I also love it at night because it completely takes away your makeup without over stripping your skin and wipes away pollution. It can be used for a deep cleanser. It can be used as a moisture mask if you just leave it on your skin for like 10 minutes. You can also mix this product with like your favorite exfoliator if you want a little bit more of a gentle exfoliation it can also kind of revive your like hands and bodies you can leave it on your skin and moisturize with it you again would just leave it on for 10 minutes so anyway i'm gonna wash this off and then i'll come back my skin just feels like clean it's the elemis dynamic resurfacing facial pads i love these these are patented by a tri enzyme technology so these gentle yet dual action exfoliating pads reveal really smooth skin they're also formulated with lactic acid and probiotic ferment complex so they're clinically proven to accelerate skin's natural cell turnover in 28 days you can use them after you cleanse your skin and they help reduce the look of dark spots pores uneven textures they also lift away dead cells and gently exfoliate for brighter skin I like to use these pads after I cleanse. This is their Pro Collagen Marine Cream. I love this in the daytime as well because it has an SPF of 30. So you're hydrating and protecting your skin at the same time. This smooths, hydrates, and delivers younger looking skin in just two weeks. It's clinically proven to increase hydration by 248% in just one hour. Proven to smooth the looks of fine lines and wrinkles in just two weeks. The texture is super lightweight, which I'm always looking for in a moisturizer because also it will pair beautifully underneath your makeup, kind of like a primer. I feel like my skin just looks amazing from those three products. I'm gonna have everything linked down below. You guys have to check them out. I'm obsessed with this brand. Something I always like to do in the mornings, especially now that I have my skincare done, is a little eye mask. These are from Elemis as well. Pro Collagen Hydra Eye Masks. Just like this. I 
Okay, going to the farmer's market. Let's pick out an outfit. what I needed and then I left it at home. I do this every time I make a list. That's why I should do it on my phone. But in my head, I'm always like, no, I don't, I don't need to make it on my phone. Like I can use a pencil and paper like normal people, like how people should. Everything I do is on my phone. Like, and then I forget. So we made it. We found parking. Let's go. It's 12, so I hope I didn't miss all the good stuff. We'll find out. No, not for you. Milo got dog treats, didn't you? Are you gonna sit? Come, show them. Sit. Good boy. Good boy. Got some flowers. And, but I got a lot of strawberries. I got a bunch of spinach and arugula because that's normally what I make with my salad. That's like the base I use, or I'll use arugula on my toast. And then, Grapes and avocados, and that's basically it. I kind of wanted to just get out of there because it's kind of hard to walk through that market with a dog, I'm not gonna lie. Putting my flowers in a vase. I think they add nice color, and then these ones here. Hi. Do you want some lunch? Are you hungry? Do you want some lunch? Sorry for that noise, it's my vacuum. Do you want some? It's lunch time for Milo. Good boy. Go ahead, good boy. I'm gonna make some lunch for myself. This is not the most skilled chef lunch. This is what I do when I'm super lazy and I wanna make something really quick and like kinda healthy-ish. Um, but yeah, it looks like a child's meal for a four-year-old, so don't judge me. Thanks. Basically, I take one of these wraps. It's like a low 
carb something. I'm just gonna take some like deli chicken, okay? I don't wanna hear it if you think this is gross, whatever. <laughs> it looks disgusting. Ew, some mozzarella cheese. Okay. I'm regretting even showing this, but it's good. It's a little plain. I don't like condiments. Like I hate mayo, I hate mustard. So if you're confused why I didn't do that, I just don't like it at all. How to make something look unappetizing 101 with Olivia Jade. I'll just kind of roll it up. The worst wrap you'll ever see. If anybody tried this, they would hate me. It's like so bland, but I like it. I know I shouldn't pick my skin like I know better, but this, it's got to go. Don't do this. This is your sign to not pick your face. I'm going to continue picking my face. I shouldn't have done that. And I knew it. I made it worse. Like so much worse. I need to get a mask. Come with me. I have this zinc and sulfur mask. That's good for breakouts, so I'm gonna put a little on this. But first, I'm gonna wash my entire face. I think now I should just have a clean face probably. I'm gonna use my Elemis cleansing balm. Ow, it hurts. I'm gonna take the facial pads to make sure I got everything off. It really hurts though, which is making me think it's not all the way complete. Putting it on all my blemishes now. Well, you win some, you lose some. I lost this one. I'm gonna wash this off because Milo and I are gonna go get flowers for Bella. I'm going to her play tonight. My whole family's going, so I'm very excited. Okay, the big reveal. Damn it. Ow. By the way, I know it's not that big of a zit or deal like it's one thing on my chin it just it wasn't this bad before like now i can't even cover it because it's like an open wound you know whatever i'm gonna go back in with my elemis cream i'm so annoyed okay well i hope this was a good learning lesson for you that's why i did it it was honestly very nice of me to pick my face so all of you don't. Guys, I think I want to cover it. I know it's not good for it, but I feel like it's really noticeable. I don't know who would notice or care, but I am going to my sister's play. I should look presentable. No? Let's try this concealer. The key to covering a zit is to really kind of blend around the product, in my opinion. I mean, it's definitely a hard one to cover. I'm really loading this brush up with powder. Okay, well, it's definitely a lot better. Little lip liner. I'm gonna do my brows again. I'll see you when we go to the flower shop. The flower shop was closed, unfortunately, so I kind of foiled my plans, but I got her flowers from the market. This is what I'm wearing. I just put a jacket on top of this because I was too lazy to change. Here. Waiting for so Valentine's Day. Yay. <laughs> Production. Oh my god, I'm so gonna film her. Oh, oh that's how the price tag. 
Okay. Thank you. This is for my vlog. <laughs>